a loop i had to start over twice okay hopefully that's not going to be your issue all right so in a real battery in a real world a battery takes out a certain percentage uh has some resistance of its own and so now what am i going to do i've got a what have i got how much power does bulb a dissipate when the switch is open right, we're talking about power so important thing to understand is power is v squared over r and i'm talking about bulb a it's the same as bulb b they're both six ohms so I'm asking the question, I need to know the voltage and the resistance. Well, we already know the resistance, R is six. Super easy, but what's the voltage? Now, when the switch is open, we have a series circuit, right? And so the total resistance is equal to uh, 6.3 ohms, right? So I can then solve, what did I do here? I know, if I know the total voltage, oh, we, we know, yeah, we know this is 2.1. I knew there was something I needed here. So if we know V equals I R, to find the voltage in this part of the current, remember in a series circuit, the voltages drop across the different resistors. It's not consistent. And so I need to find what is the total, and the current stays the same. So I want to solve for the current. So I'd say 2.1 equals I times 6.3. Now once I know the I, I can take I times 6. And that equals my voltage of resistor A. Then... I can plug that into my power equation, VA, if you will, VA squared over 6. And that gives you your answer. Now for part B here, change colors or something, we've got how much power is dissipated when the switch is closed. It's really the same process that we just did, but you have to find what is the current traveling through here. And it will be the same, well, this is a complex circuit because we have both series and parallel. So the total resistance, um, first of all, I found the total resistance. The total resistance will be 0 0.3 plus 1 over 6 plus 1 over 6 to the minus 1, which equals 0 0.3 plus 2 over 6 to the minus 1, which is 0 0.36 over 2 plus 3 equals 3.33. 3.3, that's fine. So we've got 3, not 3, 3.3 ohms. So that's the total resistance of this full circuit. So then I want to find what is the total current through the system. So if I can say V equals IR, V is 2.1 equals I times 3.3, .3, I can find I total. Then, we essentially have a series circuit. We get to deal with the series circuit part first. So I need to find out how much my, how much my, see, it, how do I say this? The voltage through a parallel doesn't, change but you're losing some voltage right here in this part right here so i can say that the voltage drop would be this is the voltage drop of the battery lost would be equal to your total current that's the number from here times 0 0.33 not 3.3, 3, whatever it is, 0 0.3. That is the voltage of the battery lost. It's not a very big number, by the way. Then what you're going to have is your the voltage will be going through this portion of the, of the circuit will be 2.1 minus whatever we got right here. Once you know that, <laughs> I know we can then find the voltage going through here and that's your this voltage will be 
2.1 minus, we'll call it V battery, and that is your V. In your equation, power equals V squared over R. And then now you plug that, you square it, you divide, the, the, the resistance is still six, so it's over six squared, or not six squared, it'll be just V squared over six. Bing, you got it.